Hey guys, it's me Liv. How's everyone doing today? So, I am bringing you one of my crafty goals that I have for 2020. So, for anyone who watched that video, you know I said I wanted to use what I have and really kind of purge. So, one of the things that I wanted to do is really complete a paper pad set that I had. Now, this one is called Be Mine from Echo Park. I believe I got it from Tuesday morning and I've used it sporadically so you may have seen other projects with it but I've just never finished it and so I was determined to finish it so I will warn you that you will also see these projects again for another video because I actually some of them I made intentionally and some of them I made um, for, for actually a couple challenges that I'm going to participate in and some I just made for my stash. So let's go through the cards first. So what I ended up doing is making a whole stack of cards. I didn't really follow any particular sketches. Um, when I did these I just was kind of using you know, different formats that I've used before in card layouts. So here is one. This is actually using the stickers. Then this is a tall one, again, using the stickers from the paper collection that came with it. And then um, this is all paper from it and a couple of embellishments that I have for my stash. Here's another card I used. Now this is a very um, lovey-dovey type of collection, so you know, kind of came in my head when I was looking through my drawers as to what paper pad collection would I like to start with. Here is another one. Now, I don't know if you can really tell that well in the camera, but this is using a die that I bought from, um, I think it's in Love Arts. Um, so it says Love You and it has a trail of hearts on it. This again, using some of the stickers. Now for this one, I did stamp a sentiment uh, from a random sentiment stamp set that I have in my stash that says thanks extra on it and this one says happy so those are the cards that I make next up I have a bunch of three by threes that I made uh, just to use up some of the scraps that were still in there so there is this some of these stickers are actually from my stash not necessarily from the paper pad uh, but a lot of them are actually stickers from the collection itself so here's a set of three by threes that I made and again, just using lots of different layering, some arrows, bows, and stuff like that. Then I made some different embellishments. You're going to see this again, so I won't take too long on it. Um, two memory decks and an ATC. And then two rosettes. So I just wanted to show you that I am going to get through... And I, I actually feel very good about at least closing out and finishing one pet paper pad set that I had in my class. So we shall never see our Echo Park be mine again in my stash. But um, thank you guys so much. I hope you guys also get a chance to um, check out the video I did on my goals and share some of your goals and get to cracking on getting whatever it may be for your own. Um, I know a lot of you who... Uh, watch the other one did mention how you really would like to um, get use a lot of the stuff that you have uh, and so with that get out there and let's do it and let's see it and if you happen to make your own um, you know using a whole hoard of papers definitely let me know so I can stop by and watch it okay hope everyone has a good night thank you so much for taking the time see you soon bye